major water main break near UCLA's campus. Yeah, part of Sunset Boulevard closed down and there's been some flooding at multiple locations, including on the UCLA campus. Eyewitness News reporter Jade Hernandez live in Westwood with the latest. Good morning. The Department of Water and Power was able to shut off the water around 7 this morning, but now to fixing the problem and clearing the damage. They're doing that right now, including picking up these two felled trees. There are nearly 100 year old pipes underneath us right now, and one of them burst overnight. We spoke to a Deputy Fire Chief, and he said the water main broke around 1 30 this morning near the UCLA campus under Sunset Boulevard near Westwood Plaza. UCLA quickly sent out an email warning students about the break. Parking lots four Four and seven on UCLA's campus had flooding, as did Charles Young Drive north and the intramural field. Water flooded about 10 cars and about three to five feet of water. The Los Angeles Department of Water and Power is out here with several crews, as you just saw. Luckily, no damage at nearby Poly Pavilion. UCLA staff had sandbagged that area. The Los Angeles Fire Department's deputy chief pointed out what he was grateful for this morning. The beauty of all this is there are no students, meaning we've got about 300 on campus. They are in another area, so we don't have to worry about any co-mingling. I just learned that uh, DWT tells me that the water main, which broke, is about 30 inches wide. They had to shut off four valves to stop the flow of water. The fallen trees and flood water have forced closures on Sunset Boulevard between Stone Canyon and Bellagio Way. That's Stone Canyon and Bellagio Way, and it, those areas are going to be closed for quite some time. This aging infrastructure has pipes that are nearly 100 years old. And as you can see, this is a slow process, but crews are working to clear these two fallen trees right here near the UCLA campus. Reporting live, Jade Hernandez, ABC7 Eyewitness News. All right, Jade, thanks. And you may remember the last time UCLA had major flooding was back in 2014. Look at that, a 90-year-old water main burst under Sunset Boulevard, not far from where today's break is. It sent millions of gallons of water onto the UCLA campus, flooding several buildings. Buildings. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.